Hi Trailman, this is Tips from the Trail with Trail Life USA. We are in Western Pennsylvania in Siegel at the Warden Survival Training Course. We have Jim Hinks here from Ohio teaching, uh, what are you teaching Jim? Oh, we're making char cloth today. Charcoal. Basically we take an Altoids can, get it, put a hole in the top, put our uh, rolled up uh, blue jeans down in it, and then we burn them up. As you can see the ones that are burning up right now. Okay, tell us about the burning up part here. Basically, so the, flames are out right there. you can see the flames coming out that little hole. You'll put a hole in the top of the can, and you can kind of see the flames around the side where it's not sealed up as well. But it's burning the uh, uh, blue jean material inside. And when you say blue jean material, you just cut up some old yeah, blue old jeans. Blue jeans. Yeah, okay. the ones that don't have elastic in it, the old the cotton. You want okay. or cotton T-shirt, something like that. Something with cotton in it, and uh, basically that'll uh, end up. Uh, when the flames go out, yeah, that's what it looks like to start with. Let me back up a little bit here. Okay. Yep. All right, so you roll uh, blue jeans and you put them in the fire. Yeah, you can either roll it up or cut it in little squares. All right, so what happens when, this, when the flames go away? Uh, basically, the, the uh, cotton material is burned up, but it hasn't completely been consumed. Like that one there, it's just stopped burning. Yeah, and it, can, and it ends up looking like this. And basically that from there, you can take a piece of that off and you uh, put a spark to it and that starts to, uh, your ember and you can make your uh, fire from that. Wow, that's really cool. This is a great way of starting fire with a with the char cloth. That's where you're making char cloth, correct? Mm -hmm. All right, well, listen, uh, everybody's here from, what were we, six different states are doing this inaugural training and uh, they don't even know what's coming this afternoon, but uh, it'll be a lot of fun. Anyway, thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for showing us, Jim. And uh, happy hiking.